Hey guys, Zen up here. We have decided to live in this trailer for the next year or so. And we're running into a few problems. And I thought that we would start sharing those problems and issues with the world. So you can kind of get an idea of what it would be like if you decided to go from what a six bedroom home to a three bedroom home with a huge garage to this first thing we're having a problem with is where does this stuff go we have the trailer and we have our little uh, trailer here and we have a big ass tent right now we're using for storage for all the stuff that we just couldn't part with you can see in here that it is completely packed and you remember this tent from the camping video and how big it is it is completely full with our stuff a lot of prepping stuff a lot of game stuff that I haven't gotten rid of yet uh, let's see prepping stuff whatever all in here tools are all in here all the camping gear is back there in the corner this is all stuff that we couldn't part with plus we brought some of the stuff over here the some of the barrels and the piping and stuff like that more tools I uh, brought the Faraday cage, yay! And we just don't know where to put all of this stuff. Plus, we have another uh, storage unit that the E-Hall people gave us free for a month that we have to um, put all of that stuff that's in there somewhere. Now, over here by the chicken coop in here somewhere and we're going to go through and hope we don't step on a critter is where I bought and laid down a storage shed that we need to put together I really don't know where it's at because of all the stuff being buried back here we're going to go until we step on it it's all laid down here somewhere there's a clearing it's probably up there Anyway, this thing I thought I was going to be able to put together, it's like a 10 by 12 metal shed. And it turns out, yeah, I'm not going to be able to do it by myself. There's just too many parts and pieces to it. But here we go. So down here is the storage shed. And it is going to go kind of right here-ish. We have to clear all this back out. All this was chopped down when I laid it down here about a month ago. Chop all this down again and start putting that thing together, which is not going to be fun. By myself, it should take me about, I don't know, 72 hours of solid work just by myself. Today it's supposed to take three guys, three eight hour days to do. So that's a lot. It's been a couple months since the last footage and here you can see that this whole area that had all that brush in it is now cleared out. And there's some brush over there and there's some brush in a pile around the side of the chicken area. But most of it got chipped up and spread out over garden area space. Here is the shed completely finished and you can see a lot of our stuff is in here from the tent and the storage unit. We still have the storage unit though for a little bit longer because my mother moved over to the side of the mountains and once we got it emptied her stuff went into it. So there is the storage unit all shiny and done. I hired one of uh, the wife's co-workers to help me with this and uh, I don't know I think we did an okay job well that's all I have for this video as always don't forget to comment rate subscribe check us out on the website and we'll see you guys on the next one